One of those is our game of the week that has major playoff implications, Tim. Oak Ridge and Campbell County are jockeying for a playoff position. The Wildcats would clinch a home playoff game with a win. Campbell County could force a three-way tie for second place class in Class 5A Region 3 with a win. It didn't take long to get the party going for Oak Ridge. This is DeJavis Dozier taking the handoff, breaking a tackle. He's all the way down to the one-yard line. Wildcats scored on the next play. After a turnover on downs, Oak Ridge strikes again. Ethan Garza to Brandon Hayward on the screen. Picks up a good block outside, and it's a house call just like that. 14-0 Wildcats. Oak Ridge pouring it on. Garza this time finding Connor Cummings. Coach's son. That's right. The coach's son shakes off the defender and carries another into the end zone. And the route was on. Oak Ridge wins big. 41-6 the final. Now joined by Oak Ridge head football coach Scott Cummings. And coach, this Campbell County offense, they've been scoring points all season long. Only six points tonight. Just talk a little bit about your defense and the performance they put together. Josh, it was, it was awesome. Uh, you know, Coach Ayers and our defensive staff put together a great game plan, and, you know, we, we're finally getting healthy. You know, that's a big thing, right? I mean, we've been uh, banged up all year, and we're finally starting to get healthier. And, and uh, to come out here and execute the defensive game plan like they did against a very high-potent offense in Campbell County, you know, this offense has scored on everybody. Um, you know, they're very sound and very good at their passing game concepts. And, you know, we were able to defend it, get a couple of interceptions. We were able to get pressure on the quarterback when we, when we needed to. And uh, just a great effort by our kids. And on the other side of the ball, you guys got it done offensively. Uh, Dozier finding the end zone a couple times. Just talk a little bit about the offense and, and, and how well oiled of a machine it seemed like tonight. You know, we, we've got dudes, you know. Um, you know, Brandon Hayward, Jai Hunley, Javis Dozier, you know, Mon uh, M Manny Rambert, and, you know, my son Connor got him a touchdown, you know, early. And, um, you know, we got the guys out there. We've had to grow up a little bit up front on the offensive line because we just returned zero experience up front. So, uh, you know, we're finally starting to gel a little bit. And, you know, we've uh, played three quarterbacks this year. And, uh, you know, Ethan Gars is pulling the trigger now and getting more and more comfortable. And, this was his fourth game of high school football at quarterback. So, you know, hopefully we're continuing to grow every day. And so hopefully we can make a run here in the playoffs. And, and speaking of the playoffs, lock down that number two seed today. How big is it to get a home playoff game? Hey, anytime you get to play in Oak Ridge at Blankenship, it's a big deal, right? Awesome, Coach. Thanks so much for joining us. Congratulations on the win. Hey, thank you very much.